How's it going everyone, PRM Collectibles here with another video. And so today we have One Piece Awakening of the New Era. So let's get started. And so here we have a booster box of One Piece Awakening of the New Era. So this is the latest booster box at the moment. And this actually marks the one year anniversary of the One Piece card game. And as you can see from the design of this box, the biggest thing here is the debut of Gear 5 Luffy. And in addition, this set also contains cards from the Sky Island as well as the Revolutionary Army. Here's a close-up of the booster pack. As you can see, it is mostly white, and it has Gear 5 Luffy there in his iconic pose. Let's go ahead and open up the first pack. And so here we start off with Choppa Emon. So as you can see, this is not just a regular chopper here. Go ahead and move on. Mozambia, Navy card. Oh, so here we're starting again to the Sky Island R now. Captain McKinley. Oh, we also have the Celestial Dragons. I wasn't, oh, that makes sense. It's with the Revolution Army set. So that makes sense why it's there. So here we have Mr. One, which we've had in previous sets too. Hino Bird Sap. It's a waste of human life. That's Kobe over there. And so, Inazuma, Cobra, Sakazuki. And so I always think it's interesting like how they kind of go by different names, like I guess nicknames. And Satori, he's the Sky Island person there. So let's see if we get anything else. Zoro Juro. And after taking a closer look at this card, it's really cool. As you can see here is Sanji there. Here is Zoro, and then I don't remember her name, but there she's being carried by Zoro. And so here we start off with Bunny Joe, and this is a character I'm not familiar with yet. Um, I'm in the beginning of the Land of Wano arc, so I'm not too familiar with Revolution Army that much. Pagaya, I don't even know how to pronounce this, Arquis, Be Bellamy Pirates, so we're going kind of a little bit back, Holly, Emporio Energy Hormone, Lieutenant Spacey, the moon, I don't know what that is, so again, I'm not caught up at the moment, Charleston, One-Leg Toy Soldier, Ivankov, Hacha, so here we have X Drake, really cool card. I like his character design overall too. So let's see what we have here. So we have Kizaru. So let me adjust that a little better here. So this one is a super rare card here. And this one's a pretty cool design. It has his characteristics, his obvious face like that. And it is pretty shiny here, so cool. So we start off with our first super rare card and it is Kizaru. Here we start with Bunny Joe again. Okay, okay, that's another re So we're getting, that's the first time I've ever gotten that many repeats. So it almost seems like it's identical to the other pack or just the other ones, but we start off like that. Bellamy, Dragon Claw. So another Celestial Dragon, Saint Rose Ward. Hotori. Here we have Stick Sickum, Meteora. Viola. Let's see what we pull out here. And so when you're at sea, you fight against pirates. So there we have this card, which is pretty cool here. And let's see if what we have behind it. And so we have Sabo. So this one here is uh, another super rare card here. And so this one, the 
The uh, hollows are very interesting here. It kind of seems like the camera captures it a little weird because it's a little red and shiny and gold kind of. So here we have Sabo. Start this next pack with Toto, Kuin, John Giant, Nola, X Barrels, former Navy, Gamma Knife, Riku. We had that one before. El Thor, so a Sky Island move there. We have Frenoske. This one's pretty cool. Then let's see what we have here. We have Karasu, and then we have Vivi. Here we have Sarquis. Don't know how to pronounce his name. It's been a while. Buffalo, Delamation, Pagaya, Elliston, Mary Jose Yama from Sky Island. It's been a while. I need to kind of revisit the Sky Island. I know it's not the most popular arc. Here we have Doflamingo, Onami. Here we have more. Let's see what we have behind it. it. Looks like it might be like a super rare or something. And it's just, yeah, it is a super rare actually. So here we have Rob Lucci, one of uh, my favorite of the villains too. I really like the design too, and as well as his uh, uh, pigeon there. It's a really cool, or dove, I guess, I'm not sure. But yeah, it's a really cool card. So here we have Rob Lucci of the CP0. Here we start with Bunny Joe again. I feel like I've gotten him the most so far. Orobi. So we have that same Celestial Dragon again. So Doflamingo as a child here. Birdcage. Heck. He was the a Fishman, if I remember. Yeah, Fishman. Revolution Army. Dragon Claw. Here we have Pell. 4,000 Brick Fist. Same Doflamingo card. Let's see if we pick some rares here. And then we have, because the side of justice will be whichever side wins. And then let's see if there's any super rare card. And here we have um, Gidatsu. So this is just a regular rare card, but it's pretty funny <laughs> expression here. Chopa, Emon. So it seems like we might start getting some repeats here. Akuba, or more frequent repeats, I should say. Toto, yeah. So Jimbe, that's the first time we see him here. Then we've had that one before. So might start speeding along a little bit if we get so many repeats. 4,000 fists, yep. And so here we have um, Isho. So from the Navy there, we could see, guess that looks like a Rocky's throwing or almost like a meteor. And so let's see if we pull a super rare here, anything special. And so it's just a regular rare card here. So it is 2 million volts Amaru. So here we have, um, I forgot his name just now, Enel. Enel. And as you can see, that's just not regular Enel either. It has his uh, second form there. We start this pack off with Maynard here, or Maynard. Steria. Oh, I see, I remember him. He's the uh, brother of um, Sabo. And, or adopted brother, I should say. Captain McKinley. Honekichi, so that's Brooke there. This one's actually a really cool design for his card. So here we have Bellamy again. Emo Bird Sap. There he goes. 
Nico Robin. So this is just, um, oh, that's when um, she was, uh, I forgot what island this was, but that's basically where the Revolution Army finds her, I believe. Upper yard. So here we have a character, or a leader card, excuse me. Bello Betty. And let's see if we're pulling any rares here. So we have Killer. I always liked Killer's design. He's really cool. So let's see if we pulled anything special. And here we have Hina. Again, we have Doflamingo as a child. Mozambia. Oh, yeah. All right, so yeah, we'll start going through Rosewood. At, Rosewood, I mean, I'm not sure if I've gotten him before. So here we have, oh, the hormone one. So that's when he was giving Luffy hormones. Like, I don't know how many times in that arc. Pell. Bastille here. El Thor. Okay, and here we have Beppo. So he's from um, the Heart Pirates. And so let's see if we pulled out anything special. And we just have Virgo. Here we have Kuma. First time getting him in this set. Lieutenant Spacey, I don't remember him. The moon, I don't know what that means. I have to catch up. Baby five as a child. I wonder if, the, if that means we're going to get law as a child as well. So here we have Usohachi. Nazuma. Sakazuki. And this is a leader card. I think this is the first time I pulled it in the set so far. There we have baby five. And let's see if we pull anything special here. And then we have Shirahoshi. We start this off with Hakuba. Stainless. I don't remember him, honestly. I'm not sure if I've gotten this one. A lot of them look the same because of how they're dressed and their fancy hair. So I noticed that I got a few different ones, though. Gamma Knife. So that's Law's attack there. Dragon Claw. And Miss Double Finger, so that's the first time I've gotten here. And so if I remember, she was, oh yeah, she was the one that went against Nami and lost to her. Punk Rotten. Same card there. And as we could see, there's some fancy foil in the back. So first we have here Om. So here, let's see what there is behind it. And we have a Koala here. And so this one here is also a super rare card, and this one's pretty cool design. It's a very different style, very fitting for a character too, I think. And so here we have a Koala super rare card. Here we have Sangoro. I believe that's the first time I've gotten it in the set so far. Gladius. That's Pika. Oh, I went too far accidentally there. I didn't see it, but if you guys saw you, you know what's coming. Kotori. Nifal Tree. Cobra. All right, and so here we have um, Don Quixote Rocinante. And um, that's uh, Don Quixote's, uh, oh, De Flamingo's brother. So let's see what we have here, Beppo, and let's see what's behind it. And it is Fire Fist, so he can start off here with a repeat. Tenet Spacey. Hacha. Hotori. So here we have a Bello Betty uh, leader card. 
Here we have Vivian, let's see what we pull here. And it's another Hina. Here we have Stainless again. Only. Oh, I think this is actually the first time I've gotten Hawkins here. So really cool design there. Revolution Army Headquarters. <laughs> Monkey D. Garp. This is the first time I've gotten this card here. And it's such a funny design on it too, which is pretty cool. And here we have a Sabo Leader card. Let's see what we pull here at the end. So Shura, I believe this is the first one I've picked here. So we have a rare one. Let's see if we have anything special. Oh, apparently there's two more. Okay, so hot torture patch work. So that one we have there. Let's see what's back here. And so this is the Dawn card of this set here. So I haven't seen this arc happen yet, so I'm not too sure what it is, but I'm assuming that's probably um, an iconic scene of the series when he punches, uh, I forgot his name just now, um, when he punches Kaido. So here we have the Dawn card of this series. Start off with Gladius, Nola, and John Giant. So the same, similar as the Garp one. We did have this one earlier, but it just reminded me of it. Onikichi. All right, so we'll just be going along here. Yama, I don't remember if I had this um, yet. So stick, stick them, meteor. I think I did have that one. Elizabello the second. So I believe that's the first time I've gotten him so far. Then here we have Franoske. And then we have Hound Blaze. And let's see, it looked like the one behind this is special. So let's see what it is. And it is an ulti here. So this is a super rare card as well. Uh, Animal Kingdom Pirate. So here we have ulti for the super rare. So I think this is the first time I've gotten Amazon. So here we have her. Okay, and here Lindbergh. So from the Revolution Army. And so let's see what was behind here. And here we have a Kaido card. So this one is a secret rare card. So this is the biggest pool I have so far. So this one's really cool. Kaido has a really cool design in his normal form as well as his dragon form too. So this is really cool. So here we have a secret rare Kaido card. Starting off with repeats and we'll go through here. Birdcage. Chaka, I don't remember if I've gotten that one so far. So here's Chaka. Upper Yard, I believe that's the first time I've gotten it. Viola. Let's see what we have here. So another Soto Judo. Let's see if we have anything special here. And we have another Bello Betty card. All right, and so here we have a Monkey D. Luffy leader card. So that one has a really cool look to his design. He looks really, pretty much really cool here. He doesn't look like his usual self. It's a determined face Luffy. So let's see if we have anything for the rare cards here. 
man man cherry so that's the first time i pulled this card and let's look it's behind and we have ohm So I don't think I've had this one before, but this is a kid loss. So I kind of thought this would be in the set after we saw like Don Quixote and like Baby Five as well, kind of in their children form. So here we have Law. Conis, I don't, I don't remember if I pulled Conis at the moment. So here she is. I bid 500 million. So here we have another x -trake. Let's see if we pull anything special behind here. And we just have another Satori card. Accidentally pulled two there. All right, and let's see what we have for the rares. Here we have another Fire Fist. And then here we have Captain Kid, Eustace Captain Kid. So really cool card here. So this is a super rare card. And now we're coming down to the last four packs. And so, so far pretty good. I liked a lot of the cards, especially the Secret or Kaido. Let's see if we could get another big pool. And this one, I actually have pulled it already. And so now here we have Enel. So finally, we've gotten him. It's a super, a super rare card, excuse me. So here he is the main villain of the Sky Island arc. And so here we have his normal form. We kind of had him in his uh, second form and like one of the attack cards. So here is Enel, super rare card. Here we have a Shirahoshi rare, which I think I've gotten before, unless this is a different one. And let's see what we have behind there. And then we have a Sabo super rare alternate arc. Uh, excuse me, I can't even speak. An alternate art card as well. So here, as you could see, has the SR with the little can. Oh, there it is. So with the little star tag here. So this is a Sabo alternate rare. Almost was gonna drop the cards it felt like. Here we have Let Us Begin the World of Violence. So I think this is one I haven't gotten so far yet. Here we have Hotori. When you're at sea, you fight against pirates. So actually we have, that was one of the earliest ones. I just remembered that. So here we end out with Rosinante. And so here we have the final pack. Let's hope something good is in here. All right, so these are all just repeats of stuff we've had. I think that, yeah, this is first um, an L leader card I believe I've gotten. So at least we have something new there. Virgo. Okay, and I think I spoiled the last one, but here we have Isho, and then we have another Dawn card.
And so a quick recap of the biggest pulls I've gotten. So we'll start with the regular super rare cards. So here we have Rablucci, Koala, Enel, Eustace Captain Kid, Ulti. We have um, Kizaru. Usually I never call him Borsalino. And then here with these two, on the right here, excuse me, on the left, we have the alternate card. And then here on the right, we have the regular card. So these are both the same cards, just this one's the alternate art version of it. And then here we have the secret rare Kaido card. And so that's it for One Piece Awakening of the New Era. So if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and subscribe. Follow me at PR Mastodon on Twitter and Instagram. I do have a live stream gaming channel on YouTube, PR Mastodon. So if you ever want to come hang out and chat, I'll be live there. And so thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Tune this.